Hello and welcome back to Boring Dad Gaming, where today we're going to be learning a new technique called the mirror and the fan. This is the 22nd technique in Car Shark, although I've learned uh, one out of sequence already. Um, and this is, again, use, uh, like the previous couple of techniques I've been with, we're sort of tying together techniques that we've learned previously into a new move. Uh, this time we're going to be dressing as the lady again with the fan and the compact mirror. And we're also going to be stacking a deck of hands in the comp's favour. Uh, but there is an added complication this time in that we, we need to put aces in the comp's hand, but we're going to also put kings in our opponent's hand just so when they are dealt those cards they're going to have extra confidence that they're going to play a good hand and bet even higher in theory. So we're going to rehearse this and put it all together. So we're going to start off with our compact mirror which as before we're going to use to spy on a deck of cards and we can see here that our opponent has three clubs, the five, the jack and the two. So we're going to move on, and we need to signal clubs. And as before with the fan, we lift it up to different heights to indicate different suits. So we are interested in clubs, and he had three clubs, so we're going to hold down the left mouse button and move down, up, down, up, down, up to signal three. Right, now we need to go and pour the wine for the comp. And he, when we're doing this, he's going to slip a, another deck of cards into our pocket. And this is the deck that we're going to stack. So we go off to a back room, and now we can see that we need to stack kings in this hand, aces in this hand, and it doesn't really matter what goes in this hand. So first thing first, we need to find a king, and we find one here. Next, we need to find an ace. And then any other, any other card will push the king and the ace into the right hands. And then we repeat that in the same sequence. So we have king, ace, and it doesn't matter, we'll use the four. Green ticks all the way through. So that was king, ace, eight... King, ace, four. The eight and the four doesn't matter. And that's how you stack the deck. So we're going to finalise that. And we're all done. We'll just rehearse that a second time. It was quite a quick one, so let's uh, move through it again. But really, it shouldn't be too difficult to put all this together. Right, so this time we've got... Four spades, the queen, the five, the jack, and the two. So four spades, move on. Going to raise this up to spades, which is the third shape. And remember, we're signaling four, so this time we're going to go down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up a fourth time. Let go. Correct signal. Now we need to go and stack the deck again. So pour the wine. Deck goes in our pocket leave the room, come back and stack it, and this time it's the same order. So we're looking for a king first of all, we found one. I need to go through and look for the ace. Here we go. Anything the five will do. I think I saw another king this way, did I? Yes, another king. Now we need another ace, which is right here. And we probably don't want to put a king in this other opponent's hand, so let's go back to this three that we saw. And now everything's shunted along into the right order. Two kings, two aces, and two low cards. And we're going to finalise that hand like so. So there we go. That was the mirror and the fan, the 20-second technique in Card Shark, and I hope it was useful. If you found the video useful, it would be great if you could hit the like button. That would be fantastic. And I hope to see you next time for more Card Shark techniques. Bye for now.